what are the thoughts of the person that you're thinking of? So what are their intentions? Where is this connection going? So what is your person thinking and feeling today? We're asking spirit. Welcome, everybody. Welcome back, everybody. These cards are a little wonky. They're big hearts. So they're a little wonky for me to, to shuffle. So let me grab one of these. Spirit, if you can please guide me. I am listening for you now. Please share with me any loving messages that you want me to hear. I am listening for you now. Let's get this beautiful heart. Okay. So when you pass from this world, you take nothing with you, but your soul and memories you have shared with those you love. So a little bit of a making memories feeling that my soul is connecting to different people in my lifetime and everybody has put in our life, in our life for a reason. So just keep remembering that good, bad, or ugly. They're all put in our life for a reason. Let's see what this card is saying today manifesting miracles. Your dream is soon to become a reality. Trust your heart and continue to follow its guidance. So manifesting miracles. That's why we're here. <laughs> Welcome, everybody. Welcome. We are manifesting miracles. Let's put that out into the universe. Let's claim that in the comments. We want a miracle of love. Spirit, share with me this connection. What is it that my person is thinking and feeling today? What is it that you want us to know in this connection? I have four wands. I'm thinking of a future. That is my four wands. That is a celebration. That is a commitment. That is a marriage celebration. So it could be a ceremony. It could be I'm thinking big picture. I'm thinking a future with you. That's nice. Two of pentacles, a little bit of back and forth, setting priorities, could be financial issues. It could be as simple as I've got to save money. We've got to buy a house first. I want to live together first. Um, I want to improve my finances before we make any big decisions about the next move or the next level, something along those lines. I have a justice card. This is moving towards a marriage. This is moving towards some kind of formal commitment. We could be buying a home together. We could be leasing an apartment together. We are moving in the direction of some kind of formal commitment. This person has been thinking about it. I have a page of wands. This is a feeling of I desire you. I want you. A little bit of I can't get you out of my mind. A little bit of a where do we go from here? What's going to happen next? I'm kind of excited about this connection. I'm very excited about this connection, actually. Um, I have an eight of wands. That is coming into me as almost a feeling of a sudden shift where your person says, um, I see the rest of my life with you too. Whether they're saying it casually or they say it very seriously, I wouldn't say that it's necessarily a marriage proposal down on one knee, but it's almost like we start to talk about there's a we, there's an hour, there's a future. And I feel like they're very serious. I feel like they're like, yeah, we're going to stay together. And I can see us doing that in the future. I can see us growing old together. And all of a sudden you're like, oh my God, this person's really thinking about spending the rest of their life with me. And they're starting to just say things in little ways. So I think it's pretty exciting. I have a six of swords moving away from something that doesn't serve you both. Maybe we both left the past behind. We're starting to realize that this is something good. I want this spirit just said to me. Nine of pentacles, feeling very secure in this connection. Almost a feeling of getting my arms around something. You know, This is something that I have been wanting. I have been wishing for. I have been looking for is how it's coming into me. So I've got an ace of pentacles that is new abundance coming into you i mean a new abundance in what way abundance of love um a committed connection somebody who's admitting their feelings so an, a, a new abundance coming into you let's see what else they want us to know this this is moving but, you know, if you're you're curious as to what your person's thinking or feeling, this person's thinking big picture. This is big picture plans. I have an air sign, Gemini. I have Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. So we will grab that. I have a confession. Somebody has to tell you something. I'm going to say feelings are revealed. OK, I mean, I don't think it's a confession like I've been hiding something from you. I feel like it's I got to tell you, I, I really feel like I want to be with you. I really feel like this is going to turn into the rest of my life or that 
I've been thinking about spending the rest of my life with you. So this person could be ready to spill. <laughs> they could be ready to spill. I have health. Okay. We want to make sure that we have, uh, we're both healthy. We want to make sure that, you know, time is of the, of, of the essence sometimes, depending on how old we are. We don't want to waste any more time. You know, if we can be together, let's be together now. So it, especially when we're all adult adults here, and I don't want to waste any more time. Let's be together. We know we want to stay together, Spirit just said. And I don't want to waste any more time by, you know, just are we going to be together or not be together? I think we're committing. I think we both are committing to staying together. And I feel like that's what they, they want you to know. They'll be back. Expect to hear from them soon. Some of you, that could be a reconciliation. It could be a second chance, but I don't feel that as strongly as I usually do. But for some of you that are watching this, I'll, I will say that you're going to hear from somebody. It, it's more of a feeling of, I finally have found somebody that I want to be with, and I finally have found somebody that... I, I don't want to let it go is how it's coming in. So I want to hold on to that. I have no, it's not a good time. So spirits going back to this card that they'll be back. No, it's not a good time. So this is not my reconciliation reading. This is not. It's something either new coming into your life or a realization that the person that I'm supposed to be with wants the same thing. So it's not somebody I'm waiting for, unfortunately, for those of you that would want wanted to hear that. I have a vacation. We will be traveling soon. I want to take you away. How about a honeymoon? How about a honeymoon? I want to take you on a honeymoon. <laughs> That's how I feel. Let go and make room for the new beginning. This is, a, this is a new beginning. But what they're saying is that this is somebody that date night, I like that. <laughs> date night, get ready to be wined and dined, right? Um, I want the person who wants to be with me. The person who says things like, our future, we are going to be together. We are going to travel there. This is what I'd like to do um, in the future for us, making plans, that when they're making plans, they're including you in the plans. They're taking into consideration that you're in their life. That's beautiful. If I'm going to continue with this reading in a part two as well. So if this is connecting to you, join me in a part two. I'll put that at the end of the reading. But let's see what the other messages are. I have karma, okay? We have good karma and we have bad karma. It's coming into me as the new door opening and it's coming into me as maybe I got rid of some kind of karmic toxic energy and now that new door is opening and I'm ready to receive this new love. Dating queen, I like this. I like the feeling of it's date night. It's date night, okay? It's like, it's date night. Here we go, right? Like, I'm ready. I'm ready to get dressed up. I want the flowers. I want the presents. Um, we, we all want that. We all want that date night. That's cute. I have a fair male. Okay, that could be a clue. I have work, connecting to work, profession. We could have synergy in our profession. Maybe I met this person at work or we have the same um, industry that we could work in, something like that. I have communication, ready to reach out. How about that? Where's my date night? You know, like this person's ready to call you. So we've got this person coming in with um, expect a call, you know, <laughs> like expect a call for date night. You know, it's as simple as that. I like this energy. I really do. I like the feeling of I want to be with you. I want to spend time with you. And I also like this kind of, joy, you know, like I'm excited to go on a date with you. I'm excited to go out with you tonight. So we're going to put this out into the universe. I want to thank spirit for these messages. I am going to continue with this reading. I will post it up at the end of the reading. Hit that like, subscribe, comment. I'll put my website below and I'll see you in part two.